I was smiling when I first wrote this, thinking about the times that I've been compelled to follow the advice of another. I remember when I was just 16, I was already on the radio at that time, and the someone suggested that they wanted me to become Mr. Teenage Traffic Safety of the state of Maryland, and I did. And uh, it was a crazy thing. I didn't know anything about driving. I didn't know anything about traffic safety. Did have a lot of fun, though, going to events, and it helped me later in my life with all the appearances that we've had across the country. I used to appear with Soupy Sales. Do you remember him? The man that would hit you in the face with a pie and... uh, he was a really fine person, and um, it, we, we traveled all around to different events in Maryland. But anyway, it was, it was good in one way. It was not so good in another because uh, it was just kind of a crazy thing, but thank God for it. You've got to always ask when other people are telling you what to do. Is this the best for me? Only through remaining true to who you are, as a beloved child of God, will you find the fulfillment for which you long. You are a child of the spirit of life that lives within each and every person. And it is a spirit within you to which you remain true. And that will give you the long, the the happiness throughout your life. When you remain true to what is right for you, you will know that no one else can live your life for you. That you have to live it. You wouldn't believe the number of people that I've had tell me that uh, older people in their 50s and 60s, they wonder what's missing from their life and then they realize they have an aha experience that they were doing something for Uncle Fred or, or their mother or their grandmother and they've been gone for years They live their life to please them, and they have not yet started to live their own life. You've got to remain true to find happiness. You've got to be the person that God created you to be. You know that no one else can live your life for you. No one else can fulfill the purpose for which God has created you. Every moment of every day, God guides you, and you're determined to stay on course. You know that only God can lead you to the place which is right for you and also inspires you to know when you've arrived at that place. It is important to be true to yourself. It's important to live an authentic life, not just one with a mask. I've done that many times, like Mr. Teenage Traffic Safety. And even though I had fun, it wasn't me. And there have been times that you've had fun, but it wasn't you. You've got to find out who you are and live the life that you're meant to live in an authentic way.